Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to our brand new EAFC 24 video. This is Leo here bringing you another special player review guys and we continue the reviews for Trailblazers Team 2 and we take a look at one of the most underrated cards from team number two and his name is Danilo Luis Da Silva known as Danilo yes guys I am I had a choice between him and Brandt and I decided to go with Danilo because his stats are absolutely insane and he's gonna be a very good option for the Serie A and like I said man he is definitely gonna be a top tier center back in the game especially this next couple of weeks he's six foot medium high three star four star right footed mostly lengthy acceleration type can play center back and right back and when you look into the in-game stats guys this is what i'm saying he looks amazing first is 78 pay 73 acceleration 82 sprint speed does get increased plus four width uh anchor chemistry style and i did go with an anchor because i did want to increase the physicality defending and pace and i think boosting that physical stat is going to make him even a more insane center back passing of 78 exceptional passing for a center back 82 short passing 80 long passing dribbling of 78 you got insane reactions at 84 great composure great ball control agility and balance might be meh at that right back position but at center back that is very good Defending of 87, highest stat on the card by far, 88 interceptions, 88 defensive awareness, and 87 standing tackle, physical of 82, 83 strength, 83 aggression. Like I said, that goes into the 90s for the strength, so that is exactly what I am looking for. Great jumping as well, so do not be afraid to play him. I know he's six foot, and he does have four play styles, guys. One, a long ball pass, and then this one, one of the most... Um, op play style plus in the game and that is the intercept plus anticipate and also aerial which uh does perform a uh, higher jumps and that is really good because he is six foot i know a lot of people like tall center backs but with that play style the high jumping it should not be an issue for danilo so i'm very excited to try out the brazilian now let's go into the gameplay portion of the review and see how he ranks among Serie A center backs Vamos Danilo, first battle, great side to side movement, I know he wants to pass the ball and get out of here And what a great standing tackle on Llorente Vamos chicos, muta lo que veo, Danilo, look at that side to side movement, phenomenal side to side movement I hate the auto switch though, it leads to a goal, I think I have auto switched on by accident If I didn't, I think I get that with Danilo Get out of here, Danilo. What a great standing tackle. So far, so good for Trailblazers Danilo here in his debut. Great standing tackle, Danilo. Showing you what he can do, man. He's trying to take Bremer as one of the best center backs from the Serie A. Again, once again, putting... Uh, what's his name? Danjuma in his pocket. Great standing tackle by... Danilo, and he's having a 10 out of 10 game. Vamos, Danilo, on a 2-on-1. 2-on-1, come on. We need the composure. We need the standing tackle. Unfortunate bounce. Can it lead to a goal? No, it can't. Nice. Dale, Danilo. Vamos, Danilo. 2-on-1. The, the team broke down, but we were able to salvage that last minute thanks to Danilo's speed, ability, and reactions.
And just as expected, Rage quit. Let's go on to our final thoughts on this incredible card. So guys, this second game, I did pick up a yellow, drew a penalty. Did show you a little bit of the jockeying speed with Danilo and then my opponent rage quit as you saw with the goal. He had enough of Kubo, which I did review. If you do want to take a look at that video, you definitely can after this one. But let me tell you, man, I got a lot of great highlights in game number one. That was a foot champs quality opponent. I scored, he would score. I scored, he would score. It was just back and forth. And Danilo definitely did a great job in securing that victory, man. Great overall performance by the Brazilian after applying uh, anchor chemistry style. Uh, I think that is the way to go. But if you do need some help with the acceleration, definitely apply a shadow. Uh, it's between him and Darmian, man. They are both very, very good cards. Similar cards as well. But I mean, obviously, as you know, uh, with Darmian, you definitely might be getting 87 rated squad. But overall, man, pace is the same. Dribbling is about the same. Passing as well. Defending, again, the same. But if you are struggling with Danilo's strength and aggression, definitely pick up Dan uh pick up this card over the darmian card just because this guy does bring a little bit more physicality into that defense but anyways i will conclude today's review hopefully helped you out in deciding whether you want to get this card or not and you enjoyed this video before i let you guys want to say thank you so much for your support on instagram and youtube lately you have been killing it with the support and i love seeing that guy so please take a second out of your day like this video subscribe to the channel and expect more reviews later on this is leo i bid you goodbye and good night